Many, many years ago, in the 17th century, the Spanish Empire entered a gradual economic decline. The numerous causes of this crisis included expensive wars, plagues, and dependence on gold and silver imported from America. The 18th century began with the War of Succession. As a result, Spain lost part of its territories in Europe and the Habsburg dynasty was replaced by the Bourbon dynasty. Your mission is to discover what happened during this period of history. Let the force be with you. Spain in the Modern Age The early modern age started in Spain with the discovery of America and it finished in the late 18th century with the French Revolution. During this time, social structure was hierarchical and very unfair. Social classes were based on status and wealth. It was very difficult to move up from one class to another. Society was divided between the privileged class and the unprivileged class. Spain in the 17th century Constant wars in the previous century and the cost of maintaining a large empire had many consequences for Spain. A great economic crisis began and Spain entered a difficult period of financial and political troubles. The economic crisis during the 17th century, Spain was involved in many wars over territory and religion, such as the Thirty Years' War from 1618 to 1648. By the end of the 17th century, Spain had lost some of its territories in Europe, including Portugal. The kings spent large amounts of money paying the soldiers and the officials involved in the administration of the Spanish Empire. This left less gold and silver for other purposes. In addition, pirates, often supported by France or England, attacked Spanish ships on their way back to Spain from America. Three Habsburg kings ruled during the 17th century. They were Felipe III, Felipe IV, and Carlos II. These kings allowed ministers to represent them and to control government administration. These ministers, called validos, became very powerful. Felipe III Felipe III was king between 1598 and 1621. Under his rule, Spain started to lose power and influence in Europe. Felipe started to leave his power in the hands of Balidos, who became the real rulers of the country. The Duque de Lerma had a lot of power during Felipe III's reign. Economic problems soon started to build up. Gold and silver were not arriving in such large quantities from America. The country was not in good hands and previously prosperous cities such as Segovia, Toledo and Sevilla started to undergo slow economic decline. Felipe IV Felipe IV was king between 1621 and 1665. But in reality his valido, the Conde Duque de Olivares, ruled the country for him. In 1640, Portugal revolted which led to Portugal's independence from the Spanish Empire in 1668. Carlos II Carlos II ruled between 1665 and 1700. He couldn't have any children. The Habsburg dynasty in Spain ended in 1700. But Carlos II died without an heir. You are a very good student. I'm very happy with you. The 
population of Spain decreased during the 17th century. Many people died in wars. Famine caused by poor harvests and plagues also reduced the population. Many people emigrated to America to find a better life. In the meantime, the population of Moriscos was increasing in Spain. Some of them were successful merchants and shopkeepers. Due to this increase in power, the decision was made to expel the Moriscos from Spain. Many children were separated from their families as their parents left Spain. This was the end of the 17th century in Spain. A lot of things had happened. The Habsburgs, kings with Felipe III, Felipe IV and Carlos II, they lost power. They lost the empire.